Good morning, friends from across the globe. Welcome to this edition of your Refoil Bulletin. Happy Father's Day to the fathers and uh, children and spouses alike in our areas. I trust you all had a great time celebrating your fathers in Jesus' name. Uh, is that time of the year again, uh, leap year I call it, football leap year, uh, when it's football unlimited all over the football carnival. Um, some are mad and some are glad. It does not really matter. Um, we just uh, enjoy the moment. It will soon be over. And then another four years, till another four years. All right. Okay. So I trust you've been having a great week. Uh, if you have not, no problem. As I used to say, it's not over yet. It's just midway. If you have been having a great week, it's not over also. It can get better. And um, I want to share with you this morning before you step out uh, a short testimony based on what we had last week on Extraordinary Restoration. I applied for a service online that will cost a few hundred dollars a month. And this service was on special offer. It was put on special offer, a hundred dollars off the normal price. And I called the customer service officer that I wanted to sign up. I said, yes, let's do it. And I said, um, but I need something more. I want some extra discount. He said, you can be serious. Uh, $100 has been knocked off this uh, offer or, or, or this price already. I said, I know that, but that's for general. It's not for me in particular. It's for everybody. Uh, but I want something on top of that for me. He said, why? Uh, because I'm asking. He said, it's not possible. I said, can I speak to your supervisor? He said, feel free. And I got the email of the supervisor and I sent an email to this person and said, okay, I've seen this, I've seen that, but based on the principle of ask and you shall receive, I want something on top of this. <laughs> and a few days later, I got an email from the supervisor and the person said, uh, it's impossible for him to further reduce the price of that service seeing that it's already been discounted a hundred dollars a month already but because i asked he was going to give me a six weeks of higher services that i didn't apply for free of charge oh i said okay thank you very much and uh, so why did I share that with you? I shared that uh, to encourage you that God is in the business of surprising you. Uh, he's in the business of doing exceeding abundantly above all that we can ask or think, but it's according to the power that works in us. That power that works in us is our capacity to ask and receive the capacity to believe him for these things. You know, uh, So uh, God is no respecter of person also. Uh, you too, you can ask and you will receive. What he did for me, he will do for you. You know, I want you to be bold in your asking. Ask for that help, ask for that promotion, ask for that favor, ask for that increase. Just ask and uh, you, you, you'll you be surprised. Um, before you go, I'll leave you with a word. Uh, God told the children of Israel in Exodus chapter 11 uh, that they should ask their Egyptian neighbors Notice they are Egyptians, so it does not have to be Christian. They may not be believers in the same thing that you believe in, but they are your neighbors. God put them in your life for a reason. <laughs> uh, they may have what you need, and you, you may have what they need. So God said to, to, to the children of Israel, ask for articles of silver, articles of gold, and he said he gave them favor in the eyes of the Egyptians. So whatever they asked for, they were given in the same way, as you step out today, as you go in your in your in your uh, in your capacity as a child of God, uh, someone crowned with favor, I want you to believe that the favor of God is upon you, and He will grant you favor in the eyes of your neighbors and the people that you are asking of their articles of gold in court uh, or silver, of those things and services that you need, and they will grant you favor before them. So go and ask boldly and come back sharing testimony in Jesus' name. 
Tonight we are looking at uh, on, on, on the broadcast live at 7.30, we are looking at the subject, the anointing of ease. The anointing of ease, you don't want to miss it for anything. If last week bless you, this week uh, will uh, double double bless you. you know? So the anointing of ease we are looking at tonight. Uh, so look out for that uh, for that link, and uh, when you hear it, when you see it, share it. Share this one. Invite your friends and sign in with your Google Plus account so that you can make your contribution as well. And and your your questions can be asked. The more the merrier, and we can have fun together. So God bless you. I look forward to seeing you later on this evening. So we have a great time together. Have a good time uh, as you go about your business today. God bless you. Bye-bye.